What's up, gamers? Gamer Dad here, back for another item shop review. It is Tuesday, May 9th, just past 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time in Canada, which means we have an item shop refresh. Want to give a shout out to two of my new subscribers. Shout out and thanks to Emily Keep Smiling, as well as Fortnite Plays. Thanks to you both for subscribing. As well, thanks to my subscribers who've subscribed in the past 24 hours, but your privacy settings prevent me from seeing your name and give you a proper shout out. As well, if you're watching and you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button, show me that support. And lastly, if you haven't already done so, please do consider using my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GAMERDAD, all one word, all caps. Thanks so much for your support. So without further ado, let's get into the review. So as you can see, we have a new style in the item shop this evening. So Deadeye has this new style, which is pretty cool. I like it. So we got a no hat and the flutter dark dead eye. Very nice. With this outfit, you also get the second sight back bling for 2000 V bucks. Then we also have the FNCS champions celebration emo for 300 V bucks. Nice little uh, emote there. Then we have the Spectral Scythe Pickaxe for 800 V-Bucks. We have the Dead Wave Animated Wrap for 500 V-Bucks. The Power Patroller Outfit from the Rough Raiders Set Chapter 2 Season 3. Nice and cheap at 800 V-Bucks. Next up in the featured items, we have the Lucha Bundle, which features the Dynamo Outfit from Season 5. The Masked Fury Outfit from Season 5. The pile driver pickaxe, as well as the Libre Glider. 2200 V-Bucks for this bundle. Otherwise, you can pick up either the outfits, the pickaxe, or the glider on their own. Next up in the featured item category, we have the Haze outfit from Chapter 2 Season 1. Lots of styles for this outfit. You have the Extreme, Auric Haze, and the Tough Luck Haze, as well as the default. Then we also have the Ridgeback Back Bling which has three different styles, the Default, the Golden Talon, and the Burnished Claw. 1,200 V-Bucks. Next up, the Star Shot Pickaxe for 500 V-Bucks. It's got three different styles. Then we have the Guff Outfit from the Mythical Might Set Chapter 2 Season 2, along with the Fluffle Bag Back Bling for 1,200 V-Bucks. We've got the Guffy Stuffy Reactive Back Bling, he reacts happily or angrily, depending upon the quality of your gameplay, and it's 400 V-Bucks. We then have the Regal Floof Pickaxe for 800 V-Bucks. Next up, the Grimoire Outfit from the Forsaken set, Chapter 2, Season 4. Five different styles there. We've got a default, we got a hoodie option, and then the colors can also be changed. So we got that default color as well as this white color. We also have the Hollow Skull Backling for 1500 V-Bucks. We got the Forsaken Strike Pickaxe for 800 V-Bucks. Still around from last evening, we still have the Wendell and Walnut Bundle, so this includes the Wendell Outfit. The Nut Hutch Backling. The Swiper Strikers Pickaxe. And the squirrely built-in emote. 1500 V-Bucks for the bundle. Otherwise, you can get the outfit or that pickaxe on their own. Before I look at the dailies, we've got some exciting news. We have a vaulted or a year or more category. So this includes the dare outfit from Season 9. It's been a while since I've seen this one. The streamline back bling. Good combo. 1200 V-Bucks. We then have the stage slayer. Outfit from the Garage Band set, Season 5. Kind of looks like Slash from Guns N' Roses. Then we have the Kick Drum Back Bling. For, so, nice items for 1500 We then have the Snake Pit Outfit from Season 10, the Siege Strike set. 800 V-Bucks. The Deadfall Outfit, also from that same season. 800 V-Bucks. The Knockout Outfit. Same set, same season, 800 V-Bucks. The Dragon Axe Pickaxe from Season 2 is 800 V-Bucks. Next up in that category, we have Circuit Breaker from the Overclock set, Season 1, 
1200 V bucks. De the Deep Space Lander Glider. This one is a cool one. From Season 3 Space Explorers set, 1200 V bucks. The Midnight Ops outfit from Season 3 is 1200 V bucks. The Spectra Pickaxe, 800 V bucks. The Stargazer animated wrap is 500 V bucks. We also have the Duh outfit from the Caveman set, Chapter 2, Season 6. This thing's pretty hilarious. I'm not even sure if I've seen this one in many years. I don't recall this outfit. Then we have the Pack Bone Back Bling, 1200 V bucks. We have the Fish Kebab Pickaxe for 800 V bucks. The Depth Dealer outfit from the Open Water set, Chapter 2, Season 1. This one looks pretty cool. Along with the Wave Piercer Back Bling for 1200 V bucks. We have the Bullet Slash Pickaxe, 500 V bucks. The Heavy Hooks Pickaxe, two different styles, 800 V bucks. We have the Stumpy Pickaxe for 800 V bucks. And the Square Stream Animated Wrap is 500 V bucks. Now, on to the daily items. We've got the Dominator Outfit from the Storm Fusion Set Season 1 for 800 V-Bucks. The Mariana Outfit from the Seagull Set Chapter 2 Season 3. Outfit is reactive to eliminations as well as loot. Comes with the Moon Jelly Back Bling and it's 1500 V-Bucks. Got the Squared Stream Animated Wrap for 500 V-Bucks. The Pina Clobbers Pickaxe, 500 V-Bucks. The Infectious Emote from Season 10 is 500 V-Bucks. The Focus Demo, it's a traversal one for 200 V-Bucks. And that would be it for new items in the item shop this evening. From previous nights, we have that Captain Hypatia's Level Up Quest Pack. We have all the Star Wars items, new as well as the old. Now, in terms of my favorite additions to the item shop this evening, I do like these three outfits. I like the overall style. Either of the actual base skins are cool. Dare is also pretty nice. I like the Deep Space Lander. I think the duh outfit is pretty hilarious. And I also like that new Deadeye style as well. So comment down below. Let me know what your favorite item is. Let me know if you're picking up anything from the shop tonight. Please drop a like in the video. And if you're watching and you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button for that support as well. Please do use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. I really appreciate your support. Have a great evening. And until the next video, this is GamerDad out.